While white farmers file lawsuits against a debt relief payment plan for farmers of color to right the historical wrongs by the USDA, farmers of color reflect on their hardships. Here's the story of one of those farmers. My name is Joe Barty, and I'm here at KJ Organic Farms in Elma, New Jersey. We grow just about everything. We grow okras, we grow beans, cucumbers, pickles, cabbage. We have all different types of peppers, hot peppers and sweet peppers. Surviving decades of farming, Barty says farmers today get the same price for their produce as they did 50 years ago, putting black farmers at even more of a disadvantage when bidding their product. Most of the time when I went in there, if I had a large quantity of stuff, I couldn't get a bid on, on my product. If I go in with just a little bit, they always gave me a bid. The price would be kind of high, but I didn't make anything because I didn't have nothing. I listened to some of the farmers and say like 50 years ago, the price that we're getting today is the same price they got 50 years ago. So at that, and me being a black farmer, my task is even harder because I get knocked down more and go over there. For instance, this year I had peas, I went over, I couldn't get a bed on them. Beans. I had squash that went over there and I didn't get a, couldn't get a bed on them. So fortunate we have pigs that some of this stuff I could bring back home and throw it to them, but you don't make no money doing that. But when I go to purchase uh, seed and uh, chemicals and stuff like that for the farm that, that I can use, organic stuff, uh, I pay the same price as everybody else. But when I get ready to sell my product, and I can't I have a problem getting the money for it. I had one buyer before when I was farming ask me one day, what do you need money for? Uh, I had to think a little bit before I said something because I was about to say the wrong thing. And I said, well, what do you mean what I need money for? It's, uh, I got bills to pay just like everybody else. So this is what uh, I'm going through with as a black farmer. In one experience, Barty went to auction off his produce. He recalls other farmers assuming he was a driver, feeling as though once anyone sees his skin color, he knows he'll face discrimination. And I pulled up, and one of the farmers asked me, well, who are you driving for? I said, myself. <laughs> Yourself? I said, yeah. I said, it's all right. Yeah, yeah, I guess so. But that's what we're up against. As soon as this, as soon as this shows up, it's uh, discrimination. As farmers of color continue to wait for federal relief, the USDA says that while they are still unable to make payments, paperwork is still being processed and encourages eligible borrowers to continue to apply.